Okay, so we're gonna make a little wagon. First thing I'm gonna do is throw a little um a wagon. A body. <laughs> <laughs> a <little> wagon. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna throw it all at one piece. Not gonna be that big. I think maybe that wide. That's it. So what I'm gonna do with this, press the inside. And right here, I'm going to fold this over because I want a little lip right here. Like that. Just fold it over. Just like that. I'm going to cut this off. We're going to try to make this square straight across from here. This part right here is going to be the walls. Okay. So now on the bottom, we're going to put a little piece, just as flat as you can, slightly wider than that. So I'm going to throw this, kind of out like that. You can either do it like this, or you could put a little slab there. This is just a flat little piece. This one right here, we're gonna to have to make this square. So I just pinch it like this. And this side will do this. Kind of uh, more yeah, rectangle if we can. So all we do is that. So we got that, that. Now we're gonna to have to throw a bunch of pieces in the bottom. Hold it. Now, because clay doesn't have very good tensile strength, we have to have a whole bunch of other pieces around to help hold it together. This is going to be one of the supporting pieces. This part right here is going to be the handle. Not fold it over. Just a little piece like that. Yeah, this one is, the toys are a little bit um, harder. It takes more time. But so, so this one, we're going to push it like this and make a triangle here. I'm going to cut that off like that. Handle. Now we're going to make a four tires. Now you can make the tire any size. You can make it bigger. Yeah. Up. Now once we, if you can kind of gauge the same thickness right here. <coughs> then I'm going to roll this over. That's it. Okay. So that's the size of my tire. But this part right here underneath, I'm going to squeeze it. Underneath like that. Now, if you look at the, these things, everything that we've made, I made, is just like a ves little vessel. We, we do it as one piece like that. So this tire is going to be sitting like this on that side. And make four of those. These ones you gotta torch a little bit harder because once you start building it, when you put everything on top, if it's too soft, it'll collapse. Got four tires. Now we gotta make everything else is all skinny stuff. But before we do that, I'm gonna throw a bunch of parts just for the heck of it. Okay, so now we're gonna make all the arms. So all we're doing now, this is gonna be a solid piece, the arms, to hold everything together. Put my hand like this and push down, watch the middle. See how that came up? Now we're gonna have to squeeze that up and we're gonna make it like that. This is the hard part. Gosh, it's so <laughs> Now you gotta hold the top to do the rest. So this is the only long piece you need to really need. This is going to be the part that pulls the wagon. So that's that. Now we got to make a couple small ones like this. This is this parts are just to help hold it together. So this is the axle. Okay. Now I got to throw hook caps. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I can make it easy way then. You should write it on the board how many pieces we have to do. Actually, Come let's see. So you see, watch this. Now all I'm going to do is close this up like this. And then drag my pinky. I thought the wagon was going to be easy. Maybe we should do another one. <laughs> one hubcap. So I'm gonna. This part is gonna be holding the wheels to the wagon part. So I'm gonna push a little bit down like that. Keep that thick because I need that part relatively thick. Collar it in, and then I'm gonna pinch that in like this. Right there. So now we gotta put things together. This goes first. This guy gotta go on to here. Like that. So first thing is I'm gonna pinch these bottom edges a little bit sharper. And this is that wagon. Put this on top of here and I'm gonna cut that off. So get this. Let's cut this. And put this on top. Now once you figure out where you want it, you can push the inside down. If you want it to, you can paddle it. If you have a paddle, this bottom edge of the wheel. Support the inside, and then it'll pretty much guarantee stick. Okay, so now let's put things together. This guy, all I do is I'm going to put this here. What this is, is just for it to connect to something. So I put that here, and with my pencil, I use that to make the dots. So for me, this kind of does two things. It helps to hold, push it in, as well as um, make it look like it had rivets. So stick this like this. Oh, nice. So now here's that, how the wheels are going to be. One goes in the front. Yeah, one in the front, one in the back. So, so it's going to be like this. Cool. So I got my two wheels, like four wheels, I guess. Alright. Now, the hubcap's going to go on right over there. Oh, my bar goes. Now I'm going to attach this to here. So I'm going to score here. Wet that. I'm just going to stick this right here. I'm going to push it in. So before I do that, you can get something like this and push it down. All I did was flatten it down so that it can fit over here. That part gets attached to that round. Mm. Now this goes like that. Yeah. And it's going to go to the um, wagon pole. This thing is going to score here. See, it's going to go right there. Right here. Right here. What's that thing that's going to attach to the brown thing? The brown thing. What's the middle thing for it? But I guess not. No, no, no. no. It's the same I thought, thing. I thought yeah. they were going to attach to the brown thing. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm not yet, but oh, it, it yeah. will. So I'm going to put this on first. Now. Oh, the axle is going to yeah, yeah. Well, if I put this here, and then you can see how the wheels oh, are. Yeah. So, if I leave it like this, every time I move it back and forth, this thing will wiggle back and forth. So I want to attach this together. So, that's where this itty bitty guy is coming in. Square both sides of that. And then like that, and we just have to attach both sides. So now if it's too long, you just measure how far you need it, and you just chop that off. So you see how short it is now. Yeah. So we put that there. Put that there. 
push it in. Here we go. That's the wagon. Now we're going to have to put this thing, that's that handle. Mm -hmm. okay, so, now from here, upside down again, we're going to use this two pieces to connect to this. So this is going to go like that, and these two are going to go here. Okay, so these two pieces are going to go in like this. So you see how that goes like that? So that's the handle, huh? I always make the handle face back out. And I put on just, all we have to do is put on the hubcaps. Since they're kind of wet, I'm, I'm going to score just with a circle like this. Wet that. This is kind of wet, Stia. Pop them right in. So cool.